Welcome to the R video tutorial on getting R. In this video tutorial, you'll learn how to find and install R on your machine. All right, the very first thing you need to do is open up a browser and go to this link, cran.r-project.org. Or you can click the link in the description below. This takes us to the Comprehensive R Archive Network, which is what CRAN stands for. Along the side, you can see there's various things that you can download, like if you want to know the source code, you can get it from there. You can look for contributed packages and etc. Right now, what we're interested in is downloading and installing R. Now, depending on your operating system, you will choose the one that is correct for you. Most people who are using R, probably watching this video, will use the Windows. So you would come here, you would automatically click base and then download R, in this case, 3.4.3 for Windows. The format's always been the same over the years, so I wouldn't worry if we're up to a different version. You should be able to obtain R this way. Now, if you're using a Mac, it's slightly different. You'll notice that here the uh, web page is a little bit different, and you will download your package here for Mac OS. If you're using Linux, you have to come to this directory and choose which version of Linux you're using. For example, if you're using Debian, Red Hat, SUSE, or Ubuntu. So let's pretend you're using Ubuntu only because it's the most popular Linux distribution. And then here you can obtain the actual packages for R. Now, I would not recommend you installing R this way if you're using Linux. I would rather you go through the distribution that you have. Uh, often you can find that your distribution includes R, so just Google how to obtain that for Linux and you should be good to go because you can obtain it right from the repositories. Other things that you can find out about R on this page are the packages available. These are the contributed packages. So if you wanted to, you can download these packages directly from the website. However, R has facilities for you to just type in code and it will go and download them for you. Here you can notice that there are 11,972 packages available as of today. And if you want to see them sorted by the date of publication, you can see here are the list and you can see that I am recording this video on December 8th, 2017. And you can see all of the videos that were recorded, or not videos that were recorded, sorry, uh, all of the contributed packages that were uploaded today, all the way down to here. So there's all of these new packages, and actually they're maybe not all new, they might be updates to packages that are already available on the uh, our archive. Hopefully you found this very easy to get R and install R. I look forward to your success in R and hope you watch the next video.